what is up youtube i am doing a collective thrift haul which is really easy because half my closet is thrifted clothing and the other half is really overpriced clothing from the mall not too hard to get there the trying to push trying to like balance my phone on my makeup stand so I gathered today a bunch of clothing pieces that I really like what I'm wearing is from a thrift haul maybe we'll give you a little OTD dress like a boy so I'm just wearing shorts this jacket I was wearing a denim jacket over it I'll show you the denim jacket in a bit and then wear some Instagram ho shoes the shirt is freaking dope. I got this at a really cool thrift shop that only lets you pay in cash, which is annoying, and they don't have a dressing room, but it, it is what it is. And it was brand new. It had the tag still on it, so I was like, hell yeah. Also, half this clothes I haven't washed, which is either hashtag relatable or hashtag gross. Either way, though. Okay. This is a Harley Davidson shirt. Freaking cute. I've only worn it in pictures and then took it off because I was going to work. So, but I think this will be freaking really cute with like um, cargo shorts or leather pleather leggings. That just to me sounds really cute. And then I'll probably wear some white sneakers or something like that. Um, it's a Jägermeister or however you say that shirt. Which I'm I think it's an alcohol. Please don't laugh at me if it is. And I didn't know that. I'm only 20, so still don't know a lot of. But the symbol board is really cool, I think. So definitely cute. It's like um it's a free people shirt. And I think that's one of the reasons I bought it. Because it was it was at a good in Portland. It's very cute. It would probably be really cute for like um CMA festival or like something to wear over a swimsuit I don't know this one is my one of my favorites I bought it at it's American Eagle but I got it at a thrift store and it looks like really weird off but on it makes your titties look juicy as hell because I love big oversized t-shirts this one is just maroon and it's got a little fishy this is a brand I see at Goodwill a lot um but I liked the little fishy and it's very comfy. So yeah, it is the Yellowstone National Park. Okay, it's just an elk. And okay, here's one that my husband said he's gonna steal from me, but I doubt it because I got bleach all over it. It's just a, a snake. I think it's, is it a rattlesnake? I think it is. Official Dubok, Arizona. I don't know if I'm saying that right, Tu, tu Bok. It's like Tupac, but with a B. Guard dog. Oh, I've heard that joke. That in Arizona, snakes are like guard dogs. Okay, here's a piece that I found today. And this is what inspired the wanting to make this video. Um, it's like a little lacy tank top, which I think would be really cute with, yet again, cargo pants. Um, or just when, summer shorts, you know. It was $3.99. I should have been telling you how much those other things were, but... Usually I don't spend more than on like normal t-shirts and shirts, like $5 maximum. I have to really like something to spend like over $10 on it, which I don't do. Like I can't think of anything that was more than $10, um, but this is so cute. I can't wait to try it on. Maybe I'll make this a try on haul. Probably not because that's too much work for me. Okay, here's the jacket that I was just talking about. It's an oversized denim jacket. I was wearing it with this outfit and it just has this. And I didn't even know this was a place. I thought it was a clothing line because it says clothing line. Bar and grill. But my my aunt went with her boyfriend to this place, I think. Very cute. Very trendy. Okay, here's something I did spend $10 on. I did it because it is vintage Puma. Look at the old Puma writing. And it was 
but it is so cool. Like, I don't know. I just thought it was really cool. It's like, I don't know if it's paying off in the video, but it's just so freaking cool. All right, onward to skirts, because yes, I am still a girl. Uh, I found this one. I, it was probably like eight bucks, which is a bit much for me, but I really liked it. It's a, it's like a little wraparound skirt. So it would be like this, just a normal plaid skirt. And then it wraps around like this. <laughs> that even makes sense. And then you tie it very cute with black booties. I bought this one on a total whim. I don't even know. I don't even remember how much it was. It was probably really cheap. It's a pink plaid skirt. It's more of the traditional pleated very freaking comfortable i didn't even try this on and when i got home and tried it on and it was this comfortable i was like hot damn i don't know what i'll wear with it maybe it'll look good with this and like a denim jacket and black booties i have not worn it yet but i want to eventually purses okay i have been obsessed with little purses lately this one I've been using the most. It kind of, it's like reminiscent of like a Louis design. Uh, it's very like durable. Like this is like, I don't know. It feels like real leather, but it was only like $3. Might even been, might have been less than that actually. This one was only two and I've used it once. It's in a picture. Um, I'm just obsessed with so this one doesn't have a zipper like it doesn't close it just kind of which I think this will be really cool for the marine ball next year because I have a dress that I'm already decided on so the third purse is this it's like snake skin but with like silver on it I've yet to use it very fun pairs of pants Okay, these next ones, I get made fun of <laughs> by my family. Um, they're just shiny pants cinched at the waist. Okay. These ones are similar to the other ones. Floral. And if you want to see how I style them, my Instagram. Okay, these are some cargo pants. I love these ones. They make my butt look good and they make my waist look small. Um, I bought them in the men's section. They cinch out the ankles. Lots of pockets. I love these because I don't have to hold a purse when I wear them. All right, these pants are so cute. Okay. Just like the shirt I'm wearing, they're real camo. And another pair of pants I don't have to carry a purse with. And they cinch at the ankles. Alright. These ones are so fun. Okay, these are like yoga pants. They're just tie-dye. And they're like bell bottoms at the bottom. I think these will be really cute for when I'm in Hawaii. And um, wear them with sandals and like a little crop top. Alright, and these are pants that I got today. They were $7.99. Got them in the men's section. But let me tell you, these make my waist and booty snatched. Alright. So they're cargoes. Okay, and then there's like these little things on the side where you can like pull them in. And let me tell you, bomb. Also, the butt looks like this. And for some reason, there's something about this line that makes your butt look good weird don't know what to tell you so yeah that's my thrift haul um again if you want to see how i style all of these my instagram is e m j o u and i love 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 styling thrifted goodwill clothes so yeah that's my video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and like and comment below which one was your favorite piece. I'm always curious what other people think about my thrifted clothing. Alright, bye.